first study that we will be discussing is addressing constraints limiting the flow of private sector investments for climate change across the textile value chain. You know, by focusing on four main pillars, uh, which is revenue mobilization, investment, uh, climate, trade, uh, and trade competitiveness, and macroeconomic governance. Uh, so, with that context, we uh, looked at the textile value chain um, across the board and looked at how or what are some of the, I mean, we talk about financing as one of the major constraints, but obviously there are other regulatory, legal, legislative and policy constraints as well that limit private sector investment uh, within, within the sector despite uh, market opportunities. When we look at the Pakistan TVC under the lens of climate change, um, um, you know, there, there are many elements that come in, but before we, we go, go into that, I wanted to... I think that the textile sector can be taken as a sort of um, a pilot project, let's say, for the government and for the rest of the stakeholders. There is no uh, national accreditation agency there from Pakistan. So how are we going to access funds? to transform and, uh, you know, do the transition. So we have analyzed a larger set of environmental goods than that in the World Bank and uh, USA studies. And we have found that our tariff rates were about 11%, which is comparable to what was reported in the USA study. 